guys, welcome back to Vibils. This is Shiva and these are our bikes. We bought them together. This is Ninja Kawasaki Ninja 250. And in this episode, we are going to install the gear indicator because these bikes don't come with gear indicator. So this is the gear indicator that we are going to install in this bike. Let me show you what we get the holders. Installation manual, zip ties, and this is the indicators, one connector, we have an extension as well and this double sided tape. So that's all, that's all we get in the kit. So let's go and install it. This where we need to connect the connector is below this back seat. So we need to open this up first and then after that the wire goes through here and we need to open these panels also right here we have the sticker on this uh, screw so i'll try not to open this and just go uh, just you know pierce the wire through but in case it doesn't work we'll have to cut it and then open that then the wire goes here and to the handle and somewhere here on the handle we are going to install the indicator to open the back seat we have this lock right here just flip it open out it comes and then here you see this you just pull it like that and below this you will have your toolkit and stuff and right here is the connector where we need to connect the indicator so let's open it up first the front seat is out this is for the right side panel, uh, left side trim and what else? The back seat. So we have taken out all of these. Now this right here, the gear indicator, it goes here and this wire I have to take through and through till this place. So I will try to do it without opening this fairing. So I just place it there. have to open it so I'll just put it like this and it reaches <coughs> seems like we'll have to use the extension also because the wire is short it is not reaching to that point so we'll just add this let's open it so I'll go red with red black with black and white with white for that these are the connectors we need to connect to the wire. white black red same white black red and this connector goes just pops in like that oh fuck it came out this connector right here uh, okay this goes like this and this one goes like this and then inside this we can install the uh, here is the indicator I'm just gonna remove this <laughs> nice and new 
it's not new anymore <laughs> okay next this socket it goes in like this you can see the gears right there and where do you want to install it here oh, I think this is the right place so okay so there are two options we can just stick this here or you can just use these brackets and install it let's say here like this so now we decided that we will be sticking it here because it is in uh, you know it is along with this meter and also it the wire will not interfere with the steering in any ways so that's why and it is easier to install also so just clean the surface and use the double sided tape and we'll just stick it here so one part will be done <laughs> Take this one out for that. We need. Looks like we were pressing on the wrong lock right here. See, we were trying to press this one and open it but the lock is actually there so you need to press this one and we just pull it out so that it comes like that yeah he's reading up his uh, installation so yeah uh, this instruction manual has uh, the figure right here it shows white uh, black and red so we have to make the connections like this and if you match up with this socket also it is in tone with that so it this has white red and black in the same sequence right there so we are going to install the wires like that and just quickly finish it up and then we see if it works or not these are not used go in the box waterproof line white black red ta -ta -ta. <laughs> part to see the magic happen just connect it with this connector hold on hmm. remember any god that you believe in <laughs> that it works <laughs> just hopefully pop it in and the final thing just secure this connection somewhere so that it doesn't you know vibrate when you are riding your motorbike so i am just going to put it in that hook like that and there it goes okay good that's done secured close this the final thing here it is the back seat closed now the final check I don't want to open it again so let's see if it works or not uh. <laughs> show this hey it works so at least it is turning on shows gear zero let's turn this thing on and we see there we go gear one and yay it shows one it showed one right yeah time for a test drive let's go so one there's one two there's two three four can go four let's go down three 
so it shows the gear only after we release the clutch so two back to two i'm going straight okay directly awesome so it works ready okay let's go we are in one If you like this video, please consider subscribing. This guy's not slowing down. Yeah, that's confirmed. He's not stopping. Code 3. Hey guys, welcome back to the videos. In this episode, we have...